Yo, what is up, bros? This is Brumanati back with the World War One mod, which I thought I was pretty much done with, besides the Austro-Hungarian Empire, which had crashed on me. I was trying to get that figured out, but somebody had pointed out in the meantime that I had never done the Russian Empire. So that is what we are going to be doing. We should be able to just absolutely smash through this if we remember to send some troops from here down to here to take this German territory. If not, we gotta wait on the Japanese to do it and they take forever. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. We've, um, we've got a good economy, I would think. Although I've been misled before. So I've got my own Nicholas II. I'm going to throw down, I think, on a armored car. Tier 4, obviously. He's going to wreck through the Turks down here. Everything else I'll make, like... Ah, oh, damn it. Tier 2. Like I said, this is... I thought... See, I can't believe I didn't play with the Rush. Usually I play with Russia right after I play with Germany and all mods that come out. Because that's just what like people like to see most. First up Germany and then Russia. So that's normally how I do it. I can't believe I forgot. I still feel like I did it and YouTube deleted it or something. Because it's not on my channel. It's gone. I swear I did this already. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot to build troops over here. Right when I said don't forget. That was literally, like, less than two minutes ago. Day two. What if... Russia stayed in World War I? That's what we're going off of. Okay, 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 okay. Wilhelm never heads east. That I can remember. I don't remember Wilhelm heading east. And yet here he is. I thought he always went this way. I thought he always went towards the UK. I'm already getting ripped off. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to put some troops down here. Okay, we don't got the greatest economy, but it's definitely... I've had far shittier. Turks are going to be so easy to demolish Russian technologies. Russian armored car technology. Demolish the Ottomans. Oh yeah, before I forget, this time around. We'll give it a tier 4 if I can afford it. Yeah. I don't know, that's pretty far away. Who knows? Um, Japan might get there first. Okay, yeah, it's going to take a couple rounds to get our front line built up, but after that, it's going to be a godforsaken bloodbath. Day three. Did I stop saying day three and say, like, week three? I don't know, I just like to say day. Sounds cool. Alright, Wilhelm, you got a date with Nicholas II. And he's plenty pissed off. Nice! Everybody has lost land already to the Russian Empire except Germany. We will be changing that really quick. I'm going to throw down that artillery here. Uh. Uh-oh. This is going to hurt. Oh, he didn't get return fire. Nice. Let me guess. Yeah, I can't get to it. How 
are the Ottomans actually putting up a fight? I'm confused. They've always folded so easy, like this is... This is confusing me. What the hell is going on here? Alright bro, get a frickin' move on. Day four! Yeah, I'm sticking with day. Now they got a general. Alright, here we go. Boom! Every major central power has now officially lost territory. The Russians are heading towards Berlin. I gotta be honest, I thought I was just gonna start this and I was gonna be halfway done by now. I guess it's that whoever you play with, they target you and, and don't screw with your allies that much. I don't like that's what's happening. Alright, Ottomans, I see you coming up through there. You're not fooling nobody. Uh, I've come to the conclusion Nicholas II sucks. More like Nicholas the 32nd. Ha! Ah! Roasted you. Okay, that's gonna hurt. I need artillery. Help take him out. I should just bypass him. I really don't even need to fight him. Oh, we're almost dead. We're... We're... Oh, man, that's gonna be over in no time. Notice that nobody's built anything yet. They're not even fighting. What about in Africa? No. Do not make me go to Africa. That would... I won't do it. I refuse to go to Africa. Day five. Then another German city falls. Just keep pumping out the tier two armored cars, something will happen. Oh, here we go. More territorial gains for the Russian Empire. Superior armored car technologies, comrade. I mean, Russian Empire, best armored cars ever. Changed my mind. How does that... I guess I never really noticed how bad infantry sucks. But yeah, it sucks. Regained all our lost territory. Alright, how far can you... Oh my god, that's gonna be... Japan might actually beat us to it. Germany is holding out. Day 6. And we might be able to get Berlin here. Yep, we got it. Boom! Berlin Falls! I need a good... I need a good song. When Berlin Falls. To the Russians. 
I don't have one. Alright, Nicholas the second has just went stupid. He's been rumored into stupidity. Austro-Hungarians are taking the wrecking that you had anticipated. I have I have stopped the Ottoman offensive through the Black Sea. You thought that was gonna be open? Nah. I seen that coming. I seen your little offensive. Have my allies done anything in Africa yet? No, they're not even building troops. You're not seriously going to make me go there. Because, I, like I said, I refuse to go there. I'm not going there. If it's not taken when I'm done, it's just not getting taken. Okay, seven. Nicholas II is still completely stupid. Oh, we're meeting up with our French bros. And our British bros. Having a meet and greet. We don't trust them, though. They, they want to steal Russian armored car technologies. Not gonna happen. It's our technologies. Oh, look at my French bros. Thanks. Kind of you. And the Ottomans already appear not to have much time left. Not the Ottomans. What am I talking about? The Austro Hungarians. Much better. The Ottomans have a little bit longer left. I gotta say this, although they folded, which we knew they would, obviously, they lasted longer than I thought. I thought I was gonna like steamroll them. Nope, they held up. They held their ground for a little bit, even had an offensive planned. They failed offensive, but it was still an A for effort. They get a participation medal. Look, you tried. It's all you can do. All right, let's visit our bro out here. How's your sailing going? Slower than ever, I see. Day eight. Finally, beat Wilhelm. Although he left Nicholas II still stupid. Okay, so. That, oh, I can see something. I'm gonna say that's all we had left of Germany. But they got a port here. We're gonna have to take, oh, and yeah, what am I thinking? We still got that island I've been bitching about.
Poor Austro-Hungarians. I'm sure they thought this war was going to be, be go better than this. Ottoman ruler coming back in now that they've seen Anchor about to fall. Alright, well, head this way. Bro, I don't know why you are so slow. Nobody's built anything. Africa, anybody trying down here? No, they just don't. Nobody gives a shit about Africa, I guess. Nobody cares. I guess we're pretty much done up here. Finish off the Austro-Hungarians next round. Turkey's gonna be... Outlasting everybody. Day number nine. Okay. Here we go, Austro-Hungarians. Boom! Austro-Hungarians go down. This guy refuses to go down. I guess I need to hit Istanbul. Nice. You think after, say, all this stuff is taken over, we'll start popping up troops in Africa? I'm seriously not doing it. I refuse. Looks like I am going to be able to beat the Japanese. I'm going to start building some higher tier stuff down here. Perfect. Day 10. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight through Albania again. Hey! Hey, 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 hey. Almost forgot that one. Again. There we go. All right, Swiss. Time to get wrecked. Come 
Come on, pick up the pace. You're supposed to be the fastest country. You're not as fast as I thought. You're nowhere near as fast as I thought this was going to be. Going. Perfect. Day number 11. Boom! Swiss go down. There we go. Damn, this bro will not go down. Die already. Thank you. Oh, we got the Belgians, Belgians coming and helping. Nice. Don't worry about that port. And not too much left. I forgot about our German port up here. Got it. Uh, I was just stretching. Obviously, I know they got territory in Africa and down here. I know that. I know they got some New Guinea territory. Day number 12. And we have arrived to wreck Istanbul. And indeed, wrecked Istanbul. Alright, Ottomans. Boom! Ottoman Empire goes down. Look, 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 look at, look at, look at, look at the Belgians are, oh my god, they're producing troops. Holy crap, Flapper. They're doing it. So really all we got left is for me to get to New Guinea and for them to take out Africa. Although that was open before and they didn't even move on it. So... Whatever. Day 14. Now they're producing some troops down here. Day 15. Damn, look at the Japanese coming now. Africa, what is going on here? Okay, they took that territory. They're heading here. Nobody's heading that way yet. Day 16. Let me in here. Give me my glory. Day 17. And this is all occurring because somebody didn't want to build troops till round 10. Alright, we got one German held territory left in Africa. Most surprising battle. The Ottomans didn't go down as easy as I thought they would, being Russia. There, anybody want to take this? I've opened it up twice now. We're going to have to count on the AI. I hate counting on the AI. We're going to have to count on the AI to finish this. Alright, we took that. Yes! The French! Always count on the French! The Japanese are even showing up. There's one thing that's always said in warfare. that You can always, always count on the French to come through clutch. They've opened up the city. Last round right here. 
Boom! Victory in 20. Russian Empire sticks in the war. They are able to completely crush the Ottomans, the Austro-Hungarians, and the Germans. Bros, if you're enjoying this content, you know to do something like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and I will be back here for our next upload. Peace! Bruminati, out.